The Detroit Lions took down the Los Angeles Rams in Matthew Stafford 24-23 for the franchise's first playoff win since 1992. Our sports director Ian Kress and Tyler Dresiga were at Ford Field and are here for you now with more on the meaning behind this big victory. Sunday night's game against the Los Angeles Rams was built up to be the biggest game the Detroit Lions have played in the last three decades and it certainly makes sense when you think. Last night was their first home playoff game since 1993 and the offense certainly got the crowd involved early. Jared Goff and company came out, scored three touchdowns on their first three drives. Yeah, and it's a good thing too because the offense kind of came to a screeching halt after those drives. They mustered just three points the rest of the game. Matthew Stafford had the Rams offense clicking as well. They didn't even punt until the first drive of the second half, but the story of the second half for the Lions defense was being able to bend but not break. Yeah, the, the Rams were able to move the ball a little bit, but ultimately they had to settle for field goals and scored just six points in the second half. Another thing that helped the Lions, the crowd at Ford Field. The players, they knew how important a win in the playoffs would mean, but now that they have actually done it, they see the importance to the city of Detroit. I saw one of these ladies crying in the stands, and you can imagine how long she's been a fan because she probably never seen it. So I'm just happy for these fans. They go home, go to sleep, go to work tomorrow, probably jump. Like running out of the tunnel when they introduced the offense was just nuts. And then just every third down when they were on defense was crazy. Uh, it was the coolest game-like atmosphere I've ever been a part of in my life. Perhaps the biggest joy to come out of this win on Sunday is knowing the Lions get to host another playoff game on Sunday at 3 o'clock because the Green Bay Packers took down the Dallas Cowboys yesterday. Yeah, how about that? You wait 30 years for one home playoff game, then you get two in two weekends. They'll meet the winner of the Eagles-Buccaneers game. That game is tonight. Jared Goff said after the win over the Rams that this was the best home atmosphere he's ever played in front of. But then he added that he expects next week to be even better. Yeah, it should be fun indeed for now, though. Reporting inside of Ford Field, I'm Ian Crest. And I'm Tyler Driesinger for Six Sports. And when we return, the 2024 campaign season is officially underway in Iowa. But find out why some candidates are worried about the weather. We'll have that story right after the break, so don't go anywhere. And thanks for watching Six News.